Whip it out. Hey y'all, it's all of Destiny. And yeah, if you're a real one, watch it to the end. Yeah, get it to it. When I get home, it be giving shoes off, everything. Get it off of me. Do I want to let Target show me what I need? I know you lie! I gotta go back! And that's the time living. Money and pretty women. Baddest bras in the city. That's all I'm here. That's the time living. Money and pretty women. I'm finna do my hair because I don't feel like it. Mom! That's why I told you to. Uh. Y'all kill me having the people to come with their hair I already calmed out. I already detangled. I already did. I already, if I felt like doing it, I would have did it. Mom, you wet me up though. You ain't got no cape or nothing. I'm finna blow no with Mojo doing the people. It's over here. This beauty is beauty store. How much you charge? <laughs> and she want me to do a deposit first? All right. I'm asking my mama to do my hair kind she of going to the side sure. because when we wearing ponytails and all of that, I try to not like have my hair going back all the time. What is <laughs> Why you just throw my head like that? Like what? You ain't want to sit down and braid my hair? I'm good. I like that, Ma. I keep forgetting to buy some of it. Hey, look, that's how straight it is. This was made for black hair. Y'all keep on talking about. Oh, I'm gonna silk press this with no oil. <laughs> That's why your mess on the ground. Black girl designed it. Okay. okay. I might upload this as is, no editing. Okay. There you go. Mm, don't play with me. Stay with me. Your face could never let I do this. I ain't new to this. I'm true to this. Uh -oh. Act like you know. Breakfast girl at 9 30. It's 8 40. No, I'm going at 10 o'clock. My bad. I gotta leave out at 9 30 to get there on time. I'm gonna leave this right here until it dry. Still trying to finish the Jimmy Choo, so we're gonna put this on my arms. Cause I'm trying to I don't empty it out. I showed my friend my outfit. He talked about some them shoes, bruh. <laughs> the why ain't hating so hard on me. You is you ain't even pictured it yet. Yeah, okay. Anywho, happy Saturday. My mama braided my hair last night. I left my vlog camera over there. I forgot to conclude last night. I just came in and got set up a bit. But I had a good time yesterday. I did everything on my to-do list except for my nails. I'm going to put the to-do list up so y'all can see it. I guess I'll chat with y'all later. I'm not taking y'all to breakfast with me. But I was going to say I'll let y'all know how it goes. I don't think I'm going to do that either. So it ain't even no point in me discussing what I'm discussing right now. So let me just shut up. Yeah. You don't jump to put jeans on, baby. You don't feel my power. Beyonce. Okay, girl. Oh, I forgot this. Give me a little pudgy pudge right there. I'm wearing them anyways. Oh. All right, we're going to finish the last of pink sugar and head out. Finish the last of it. It's hard to spray it when it's at the bottom. You gotta lean and twist it. I think I want to do lashes, but it's 10 o'clock in the morning. So I don't know. Says the girl that just did all of this. But I'm planning on staying out once I get out anyway. So. Breakfast went great. I am in Guitar Center now. I'm trying to compare the prices because honestly, I was looking at some on Amazon. I feel like it'll be two day shipping, but it'll be cheaper. I need to get a price on that. And then this one is 74. I haven't met up with my folks yet, so we we off the iPhone with it <laughs> till I get my vlog camera back because I left it over there. I think I told y'all that already. I like this gray one though. I don't know much about this brand. I like Yamaha, Roland, Williams and cord when it comes to keyboards. If I'm missing some of the good ones, then yeah. Ooh, she cute too. Wait a minute. Why she not plugged up? They just got her. She is cute. Why is the sustain stuck? Girl, this one got everything. Zero. Not my... I like this color combo I did today, girl. Lighting. We got a keyboard saying that I just gotta get a bench. I texted and called my dad about it. He said I could find a better one. 
better price. I don't like to grab the first thing all the time. So we're gonna compare. I saw some decent ones on Amazon. I only think about getting it in person, I will be able to sit on it and see how I like it. That'll do for now. I don't know if I vlog, I didn't vlog in Target. I'll show y'all what I got at Target when we get home to the actual camera. I'm actually gonna do my nails. So if I'm in the mood, I'll haul all of this after that. I feel like if I drink this coffee, it'll wake me up. It's five o'clock and I'm drinking the coffee because I need, I need energy to keep going and I'm tired. We gotta do the nails, baby. We gotta do the nails. When I get home, it be giving shoes off, everything. Get it off of me. All of that. I'm gonna call you back. Sometimes I'm in the mood to have my nails done, sometimes I'm not. The phase of me being in the mood to not have them done is over, so here we are. So we're about to sit down for three hours and do my file acrylic nails. Three hours for me, not three hours for y'all. I chopped it up for your viewing pleasure, okay? <laughs> so I thought I was gonna do nail tips to save time over sculpting. But none of my nail glue is working. Clearly, it's just all dried up. I was checking my press-on nails kits. I'm like, where is the glue? I already hyped myself up to sit here for three hours so we could not walk away to go to the store because I was going to walk away for a whole nother day. Okay, so now let's get into this custom glitter mix. You need glitters, you need clear acrylic powder, and you're going to need a jar. So I'm mixing in this brown, I'm mixing in this gold, and then I'm mixing in a lot of the clear acrylic powder. If you don't use enough of the powder, you ain't got yourself a good mix, right? And then when you put your brush in there, you're going to be like, what is this? So make sure you don't be stingy with the powder. I like to do this because I'm able to just get whatever color I want to get versus spending a lots and lots of money on different glitters um you can get your glitters from the craft store anywhere you see glitter girl just grab it and mix it up and see what you get i'm going to be using the mia secret liquid monomer yes i will be using that one in these nail videos until it runs empty because i paid my money for it already i want to go ahead and take my nail dehydrator apply that to the natural nails that one is by mia secret and then i'm also applying the cnd primer two coats let it dry in between each one of these steps I thought I was gonna use my reusable forms, but girl, and this, let me explain what happened. I'm adding on the mix to, I thought I was gonna do white. For some reason, I was trying to envision that. As I started blending it, I was like, no ma'am. No ma'am, I just didn't like it. <laughs> so that's when I kinda changed my mind. I was gonna blend it down into an ombre. That's why you saw me patting it like crazy. I ripped it right off, cause I was like, no, mm -mm, I don't like it. And I also didn't like the mix that we had. I normally test my mix before putting it directly on my nails. So I added in a little bit more of that lighter color. Somehow I zoned out and I stopped using the reusable forms because I trimmed my nails too short. You want to have a good amount of length underneath your nail for you reusable forms. So I went ahead and just used these instead. The way that I do my marble, I kind of just slap the colors on. As you begin to pat the acrylic into the nail shape that you want, it kind of blends them together and it gives you like this cute marble look, but with acrylic. So each nail just basically looks different. And then in the back, I'm using the Mia Secret I think that's the nude beige one. I'll put the correct name on the screen and I made sure to cover each one of these nails with the Beauty Secret Clear Acrylic Powder. I wanna link it down below. I've had mine for a while. I think uh, Sally Beauty changed the packaging. So yeah, but I'll link everything. Everything that I can find links for will be linked in the description box down below. Some of the links will be affiliated, which means your girl get a little coin, okay? If you don't believe in supporting me getting a coin, then find your own stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Not me doing this voiceover the way I do my TikTok voiceovers. Mm. It be giving all of Destiny on the visuals, Ratchet Destiny on the audio. Yeah, get into it. <laughs> so basically, I repeat that same process until all of my nails are completed. So you see me adding in a few little flakes, right? But for whatever reason, these flakes are kind of holographic, but they're like a white holographic. I literally forgot to put them in the frame of the camera. Y'all can probably see them sitting towards that top right of the screen. I feel like the color blends to whatever design you're doing. So with this specific design, they end up looking a little bit gold um, instead of white, which I like. I like the brown with the gold. Basically, we're gonna repeat that. I'm gonna come back, cause yeah, we just working on the nails, listening to music, getting to it, getting to the money, you know. Okay, stop Disney. <laughs> 
so when I've been editing lately, I pull up like the fall jazz music on YouTube and I turn it down and I let it play in the background. And it helped me get through my editing sessions. So I was like, you know what? Instead of spending hours looking for copyright free music, I'm gonna play jazz. So this video is giving jazz. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all, I gotta lay off of the coffee before I do these voiceovers. Cause who am I? <laughs> who am I? I wanna start filming myself, like the visuals of me recording the voiceover to stick that in the corner. Like the reaction channels be doing. Let me know if y'all ain't, nah, that's gonna take too long. You love adding on extra stuff that make edits and take forever in a day, Destiny. Goodness. Anyway, I start off with my hand file, girl. You get a pack of these from Amazon. I've been using them forever again until they run out. We ain't getting no new nail files. <laughs> And then after I've kind of perfected the shape a little bit, I use my nail drill. I ain't gonna even say that thing that I always say in the nail videos. If you know, you know. I can lick the nail bits though, I got you. I was a little rusty, I ain't gonna lie y'all. I had to do a lot of fouling. Normally, if you can take your time and get the nails right, you don't have to foul too much. I needed a new hand foul. Once they get a little old, it's giving mm-mm, bye. You gotta go. Make sure you remove all of the nail dust. When you go to the nail salon to get your nails done, they be like, go wash your hands. They want you to get all the nail dust off, sis. This is where we ran into another problem. Anyway, girl, so my two base coats, one of them was empty and one I didn't like the consistency on it for some reason. I guess I had it too long. So, yeah, no base coat. I did two layers of top coat. Wipe off that tacky layer. I was gonna do designs. Then I was like, I bet you won't do something different and skip designs. So that's what we did. Once I hype myself up to it, I can do it. There we have it, five nails complete, three hours, well spent. Apply some cuticle oil and all of that. And then I just went ahead and tidied up my space because yeah, I was gonna have to sit right back at my desk in the morning to get ready for church. Clean space. Six hours worth of sleep later. Hello, hi, good morning. We back, baby. And I'm about to use my new flat irons. Oh, girl, please. I bought those, like, a couple of months ago. Finally about to use them. I think I got them from Walmart, though. I love the white uh, pearl look of them. Real cute. Y'all be watching MJ. Boom, put me on to MJ. Uh, Harry's, if I'm saying it correctly, I think. That's his Instagram name. I like his content. Then he got off alive, so I was like, okay, bitch. What I was originally watching. I'm recording! <laughs> she said, all right. <laughs> So yeah, pulled up my girl Naturally Sunny, cause y'all know she been uploading for Vlogtober every day. Get it to it. Flat iron curls. And then I did flexi rise. I ain't feel like going, to, going back downstairs for more, so pin curls is also another option. Hello, hi, good morning. Excellent. No copyrights on this beautiful Sunday. Hello, hi, good morning. Today is Sunday. So I am getting ready. It's about 12 o'clock right now. I'm ex to be a presenter. You know how like on award shows, they have celebrities come out and then they present different awards and the winner is. So I was like, oh my God, yeah, I would love to. There we go, in my uncle's church today. When I'm asked to do certain things, it's always like a pleasure and an honor to be considered as someone to be asked in the first place. It's different too, so I'm gonna show y'all the dress that I'm wearing. If you all saw my New Year's vlog, then you all may remember that dress. That's the only time I've worn it. I said it on Instagram when I had to go to a wedding. And you know how you get invited to events, you're like, oh, what am I gonna wear? And I've shifted my mindset sometimes. I'll double check my closet to be sure, because if I don't have it, then I do have to go. But my mindset lately has been the things that are in my closet is good enough. And instead of going shopping, I shop in my closet. And if there's nothing there that I could use or wear, then I'll go ahead and go to the store. Um, and I was scrolling through my Instagram looking at my pictures like what could I wear again. Because I wear my stuff more than once. Instagram, don't play with me. I'm going to wear that one. Especially for the occasion with it being an award show. It's perfect and fitting. So that is what my Sunday plans are. I don't know if I'm going to do a solo Sunday day afterwards. Because they're serving dinner when that's over. I wouldn't have to go eat again. If I go treat myself to some dessert or something. Actually, I still don't have my vlog camera. The last time I was at my parents' house, I left it over there, y'all. We was having that chat about being strong, independent black woman. And everybody was just kind of defining. Well, we didn't define what it means. My parents' definition based on their age group and generation was just defining it differently from how our generation sees it. And I never put it back in the car when I left and went home that night. So unless I call my mom and tell her to charge it up for me, I have to see about getting footage.
still didn't grab my vlog camera from my mama. All right, I got my plate to go since I'm 56 minutes away. Oops, wrong thing. Let me show y'all what I got because I'm gonna put a napkin in my lap and by the time I get home, it's gonna be gone. Got a little bit of everything because I'm hungry. I had a light breakfast, so I want this now. I'm gonna try not to get dirty so I can try to get an Instagram picture when I get home. A few of us was gonna trail heading out, so I'm gonna wait on them to pull around. Mm. Baptist got mimosas. Koji gotta step it up. <laughs> I wanted to be on time, so I didn't show y'all my outfit before I left, but I'm back home now. I grabbed the stuff to tell y'all about my lip combo too, because I know y'all gonna ask. And by the time I edit this, I would have forgotten. Get out the shot. <laughs> so, heels are Gianni Vini. The anklet is Amazon, but whenever I try to link this one, I don't think it's available now. Not Gianni Bean, you wear too much Gianni Bean. This Kamado, heels, this Kamado. This dress is from the brand Ignite. I think I got this at Dillard's. I like the little tassel on the bottom. Uh, the black is not a slip or anything that I put under here. The dress comes like this. Yeah, I like gold on me, like gold on melanin. Mm. And then the hair, I like this texture because it's like a yakky texture, which to me resembles relaxed, black hair. Like after I took the rolls out, I just did it like this because if you work with yakky hair too much, you can like you lose the pattern. So this is what we have with that. Um, as far as the curls, bag is why I sell. I decided to do my black bag, bag that I chose to carry. White toes, we did my nails yesterday. We did my nails last night and then ring. This one is from Target. This was Gucci, probably Target or Walmart, Gucci. Cartier. Y'all know this is the same necklace I wear all the time. I never take this off. My daddy got me this for my 21st birthday. So if you've been watching me since I was 21, you see this necklace in every video. <laughs> in every video, okay? I don't know where it's from. Shout out to my dad. Uh, you can pay for it. Yeah. Um, lashes are a Timu, the brow pencil girl. Ran out. Let me tell y'all the look combo because I did something different. You know what made me do something different with my makeup? Let me come closer while I take my heels off, girl. 
I need to take a picture though. I'm gonna keep them all. But I do want to sit down for a second. Hold on. I was watching my older videos. My sister Boone, she was just like showing me different makeup looks that I do. She was like, this your look. This your look. And so I watched a few of my girl chat videos, the ones where I do the makeup in. And I was like, oh, I forgot I used to do that step. So I basically tried to kind of follow my own routine that I do. And sometimes I like a good matte lip, girl. So basically the lip combo that I did, I had this so long. Don't be like me. When your makeup expired, throw it out, because I don't. <laughs> so I couldn't find my, I don't have a brown brow pencil. I mean, slow down, Destiny, you're talking over yourself. I currently don't have a brown lip pencil. Uh, so whenever I don't, I just use the brow pencil. Brown is brown. So this is the uh, NYX eyebrow pencil and dark brown. I put concealer in the middle sometimes for a nudish type of look instead of more of a pink uh, type of look. So whichever concealer you wear, you don't have to use the same one as me. Use the one that you use in your makeup routine and that's going to blend uh, for your complexion. The one that I use if you want to get it though is Tan Sand. And then for the darker uh, shade, a Sacha Intense Matte Lip Velvet. This is so old. I don't even think they probably sell this no more. Girl, it ain't got nothing on there that I could really read for real. But it looks like this. So you want to use something that's like a little bit darker. Um, if you can get stripped, I grabbed the wrong one. I used naked because I remember putting it in the camera, but this is stripped right now. Um, so that's what the lip combo is. And the way to get a perfect matte type of look without it cracking, you know how most people kind of clean off the lips before doing the lip combo? Whatever makeup, as I'm doing my face, if you get on my lips, I leave that on there because that sits in the creases before you put your lip combo on top. And then I do have like a lip care routine, like I exfoliate the, my lips like to get the dead skin and stuff off. Um, so that also helps with smooth lip care products and applications. I'm also gonna show you all everything that I piled up on the couch over here. Sometimes when I come in like this, it's not really late, but I'm getting older. So sometimes to me, it's like that is late. <laughs> Um, I'd be ready to like come in and unwind if that makes sense. I'm gonna show y'all everything that I got from Guitar Center, Target. I think I went to Marshall's earlier in the week. We just gonna sit on the couch and get it unbagged. And I just stopped at Walmart actually. Girl, why was everybody looking at me at Walmart? Like I couldn't come in Walmart like this. Walmart got a new dress code. <laughs> this one. I'm gonna put the picture on the screen because I took a picture of it this morning. It was not that open yet. So I stopped at Walmart and I grabbed popcorn because I'm finna chill and watch suits. Just grab two little meals to eat while I edit this week. Not too many because I still got Hello Fresh. Um, so I'm gonna kind of cook that. I need to show y'all. I've been on Hello Fresh for months. At least four or five months probably now. Yeah, but I'm gonna start showing y'all be cook more. I just know people have their different opinions on cooking. It's like, oh, I would've cooked mine it's like that. And it's like, girl, if you don't leave me alone, this is how I cook mine, okay? For my quick little editing meals when I want something. Sometimes I give myself a 30 minute lunch break. Sometimes I kind of keep working while I'm eating so it don't be giving clock out for a lunch break. Discipline. Healthy choice, this is the grilled chicken, basil, TV dinner. I got the barbecue seasoned steak with potatoes one. Never had this one. I like this one a lot. We got somebody was telling me these was good. I'm a chips white girl over. Hold on, I feel like I'm so zoned out. I am a chips white girl over Oreos. I keep both of them over here in these jars for the guests, but I think the guests like Chips Ahoy as much as me too because the Oreos kind of sit there a little longer. But anyway, somebody was telling me that the golden ones was good, so we're going to see. They owe me $3.98. I need to say plus tax. I told them if I don't like it, then they owe me my money back. Not the store, the person that want me to try these. Well, they didn't want me to try it. They just said they like them and I said I would try it. So if you're watching, yeah. <laughs> the caramel apples. I try to grab these as much as I can during fall season because I feel like I won't be able to see them once we get like closer to Christmas. That's one of my favorite things about fall. Sometimes I see watermelon wonders, sometimes I don't. So I got the Trilogy uh, kombucha instead. Let's try the cookie real quick on camera. Let's see what I think. Oh, by the way, as far as the lip combo, the plate of food that I was eating. When I did my makeup, I didn't touch up my lip combo at all, so if you want to try that one. I don't know if it's the combo or the product itself, or if it's leaving the makeup on your lips and putting your lip product on top of it that makes it last, kind of like a base. I don't know, girl, but I ain't touch up my lip combo. It's still the same thing. This could be good. I'm good. They don't owe me $4. The award show that I went to, it was nice. 
Um, I only got like a few clips. My mama had my vlog camera because I had left it over there. I left it in the car when we got to church. She was like, it's in the car, I forgot it. But I didn't feel like going out to the car to get it. So I didn't grab it, but I will play the few little clips that I have over my phone. And then they came up, they accept their award, they walked down the red carpet, all of that. And then we ate afterwards. I got my food to go. So I was already like 56 minutes away. Um, I don't mind driving home in the dark, but I had to go on and them Mississippi two lane little roads. I was trying to be out there <laughs> in the dark. I was like, let me go on and go. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it was a really nice program. Everybody looks good too. Talk about stunning on the first ladies, baby. They ain't come to play. Everybody that was walking up to get their award, I was like, yes, ma'am. The food was real good too. And yeah, that was that. It was a good time. I need to regroup. I come straight in. And start back filming but that's because i know myself i'm out i sit down being there on facetime or just talking on the phone and before i know it i'm gonna be done snatch the lashes off took everything off went to bed i'm not conclude my video um, so let me wind down for a second and then we'll haul aldo target all of this whenever i take breaks in between vlogging i don't know how to multitask Somebody just complimented me on the phone. They was like, you driving and eating and talking to me? I was like, yeah, I do this. Oh, I like the height to be. So, I am back. All right, I only got 11 minutes on this car, so we're going to see if I can go a little quick. Uh, at the Guitar Center yesterday, I bought this keyboard stand. The brand is Proline. So, I went to Aldo. And I got, I got, I got, I got. I actually just popped in to speak because I saw my cousin I was like hey <laughs> then I started looking around after that and I've been using my nails as tools so I just grabbed three little pairs of file shoes this is the first pair because sometimes I want to wear heels but it's like I need my feet to be in like when the weather starts changing these brown pair I don't have anything like this real cute on this shoe is called Millgate I got mine in a US 8 which I think runs true to size because I am a standard uh, US 8 and women's so block heel on the back. Oh, it's like a suede shoe. My bad. I'm going real fast. It's suede. Loafer style flats. The name of this one is girl what? Something something flicks. Size 8. So I'm that person. I don't really have like an in-between. I do have an in-between but not really. So for me it's kind of giving like in the summer sandals, heels, or tennis shoes. Burly tennis shoes. And then my transition just jumps straight to boots. I been mean, need something for in between when you just want your toes away. So I got uh, this right here for a chill little casual day, but I feel like you could dress it up as well. They did have a black one, but I decided to go with the brown one. And I like the little light color on the bottom. I also got this. This is a gel cleaner. <laughs> I'm gonna start doing a better job at keeping my shoes clean. I'm that person like from head to ankle. I be like on point. But sometimes if my shoes get like a little stain or two on them, I'm not quick to like wipe it off. I just be like, whatever. But I'm gonna start doing better. I'm gonna make it my business to like spend a day going row by row in my closet and just pulling some shoes out, cleaning them. Cause when I wore those dirty forces to the airport, it's like, even if that ain't your new pair, they shouldn't have looked yellow like this. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, if y'all follow me on Instagram, Lee, I heard about that. Or if y'all saw the Miami vlog. This right here, cannot wait to wear this. It's giving. Somebody need to be trying to ask to take me somewhere where I can wear this. If I needed something where I can wear this. Like what? Bo was like, do you have something like this? I was like, I don't think I do. Cause I try not to buy stuff that's similar to other stuff. But sometimes I don't care if I like it. I grab it and it look like something I already got. But I don't recall having this color. We're gonna get a bad bomber jacket or something to wear with this to bring it in to fall. I did eight and a half on this. And this is the Ganina. These are recent purchases, so it won't be like, sometimes I whip out old stuff and y'all be like, where is that from? And it's like, girl, I got this four years ago. I can't find no link. Do y'all want to do prices or not? The Ganina ones were 140. The something something flex <laughs> uh, was 69.98 because it was about one get one 40% off sale. And then that little cleaner was 9.99. And then the other day, uh, I didn't have the camera on me. I, something, I had to get out for errands for something. Ended up going into Marshalls to just kill some time. Oh, the day I went to my dermatologist appointment. I went to Marshalls after that and I saw this cute little set. So I figured I would grab it. Sometimes I'm not in the mood to match up outfits. It's the fact that this color of this is matching the color of that. So yeah, this is the fleece type of hoodie type of whatever you call it. Grab it, zip up right here and then you could, you know, 
Do y'all wear tanks and stuff under the Yeah, you should. You should so I can get out of it when I get hot. Those matching jogger pants. If it's not in this vlog, I'll be sure to wear it in the next one if I don't try it on so y'all can see. Because, yeah, the brand is Danskin. Then they used to sell Danskin at Walmart. They probably still do. $34.99 compared to $50. I love that. I also got this candle from there. I think I already filmed me putting it in. This one. I haven't lit it yet. This one was on clearance for $8. Uh, botanical Light Spiced berry i got this purse i saw this person i said i gotta have it some things i don't wait for the occasion for it's kind of like get it put it away when that time come you got it already and that's one of the reasons why when y'all ask me like what's this what's that i don't have current links for it i just saw it and liked it and i saved it for the time best to like whip it out <laughs> so i got this purse right here we probably won't carry this Anytime soon, but holiday season is slowly approaching and I figured she would come in handy. If y'all saw the vlog where we went to go and see Beyonce for my birthday and the Renaissance tour, those boots that I wore, the silver ones. Need be when that time come, oh baby. And I think we got a little chain situation on the inside. I wouldn't do it with the chain though. It'll come in handy if I'm trying to vlog and my hands get super full. A whole baddie, yeah. And bags like this run you a pretty penny. I got this one for $29.99. Hey, we behaved in Marshalls, that's it. Yesterday I went to Target. Yeah, I went to Target because I needed to use the bathroom. And then I said, do I wanna let Target show me what I need? And I was like, absolutely. So Target told me that I need this. It's not your standard white collar shirt. It's got all these little bedazzles on it. Mm-hmm, yeah, get into it. It's basically little Swarovski's all over it. Like it's not full length, but I don't feel like my stomach gonna be out either. The brand on this is A New Day, and I got it for $28. I ain't trying nothing on. It's giving that hope it fit. Oh, you know what? Cause I was gonna pop the tags and wash this stuff. I'ma try it on, then we gonna wash it. <laughs> Let me slow down. This is the Slim Fit A New Day. Some little stretch pants. I got them in a the size eight, hopefully they fit. They look kinda loose. I like some pants when they kinda look like they should be a loose fit on you. They are folded up at the bottom, so I'm gonna see if I like that look and style. It does have functional pockets, the front and the back and the belt loop right here. I love the olive green, it's gonna be perfect. Fall. I've been having to try on and throw out a lot of my pants lately. So yeah, once we throw out something, I think it's worth purchasing something else. These don't have the belt loop or anything, but they like stretch pants. I'm wondering if I mistakenly got these and they were supposed to be in the maternity section because of how the waistband is, but if they fit, they fit and it is what it is. I don't know. I think it's just giving no belt loop probably. Let me know if the knot rose is in the, it don't say on here. $30 and then it's like the bell bottom style which would be perfect for wearing some boots with. I need to be short on space all the time if it make me go this fast. This dress, see what I mean? It's just giving it's cute and I'm gonna whip it out when that time comes. No, we gotta go to uh, BMW Tuesday. I just thought about it for an appointment, so we'll do it then. $30, size medium, it's that season. Y'all see it? And then it's basically like a long tank matching colored dress up under it. And it's giving body con, turtleneck type of vibe where it sit on the neck, but not the kind that you fold. Silver shimmer in it. So I would have to see. I don't think I would do gold accessories with it because of that. We'll figure it out when that time comes. The last thing I grabbed was just a few skincare items or some things that I needed. This is the Dr. Teal's bath oil, lavender. I think if you read the instructions though, you can either choose to add this to your water or you can rub it on when you get out of the water. It's a bath and body oil. Most of my baths are nighttime baths because I'm probably gonna do one tonight. So that makes me gravitate towards lavender and products that aim at like calming, relaxing, just to help me like really initiate the unwind routine. These earrings, I could not, could not pass up. Both of these, yeah, love them. Oh baby, $7.99, $9.99. The brand on both of these is Universal Thread. I also got the MB African Black Soap. This is for the face and the body. If I'm in the mood in the shower, I go and wash it right over my face too. But most bar soaps I just use only on the body because I usually have a separate skincare routine. And then the last thing I got, I already opened this. I picked up this skin therapy oil because I ran out of like a face oil. I have plenty of serums left, but I needed another good oil. Especially for fall, I'm gonna do my updated fall routine. If you're starting to deal with your skin drying out because of the change in weather already, I'm not a product specific type of person too much. I'm a technique specific kind of person. 
So to prevent your skin from drying out as we're approaching the winter months, just make sure that you lock your moisture in with the oil on top of your skincare routine. But you need to consider what kind of skin you got. Like if you oily and all of that, like you probably don't want to use too much oil on top. So yeah, read up on all of that. But I just grabbed this oil. I used it twice so far and I like it. That's everything I purchased recently that I had sitting here waiting to show y'all later. I'll chat with y'all a little bit later. I'm gonna get changed. It's still kind of early, so I'm gonna see I may go out. I am in here taking some pictures while we looking cute and dressed up. I think I'm gonna pick a different background, but for right now, I'm just doing it right here. Listening to some music and just getting some content, but I need to swap this battery out. I thought I plugged it up earlier, but it's actually low. I try to go ahead and get my pictures while I'm dressed up. I'm not a dress up for your pictures kind of person. I'd be torn between solid background and lifestyle background to really show the vibe of the house and stuff like that. I'm out of space on this card though, so I'll chat with y'all a little later. So I'll go ahead and get this done instead of trying to find some more stuff to delete because I just grabbed the wild camera instead of this one since I'm trying to get my pictures on it.